Okay, guys, let's look at this number 560, sub ray sums to equals to k. So we're given this uh, integer array 11111 and uh, target is 2. So we have to find how many uh, combinations of a continuous subarrays who adds up to k. Like 11 one is 2, okay. But this 11 one is also 2, so there are two possibilities. So this actually is very simple, straightforward in brutal force. Brute force, right? We just check the start, okay? Check the start and just to sum them up, like uh, sum one two, one two, and then one two three, and then here, start here, one two, and then yeah. So let's do it for let for let count equals zero. Let I. So let the temporary sum equals zero for let j equals i j If sum equals to k, then we count plus plus one, and then we return count. So that's the brutal force. So it's done, so it's O n squared, right? Yeah, In time complexity. We submit. Yeah, it's good, but it's not fast. Actually, I've looked at the solution for a long time and I suddenly understand that it's very, it's very, it's, this is a very cool question. I press the uh, like button. So the things that uh, how to say? Um, we just start one of this. Let's see. We just uh, loop through the array by checking the start line of a uh, subarray, right? Start him here if it's okay. Start here from is okay. But if we take it to the ending in the index of the possible subarray, it might be a totally different. It might be to a totally different picture. So if we take look loop through the ending, so in this one, it's uh, one. It's not two. Okay, this one is two two. Okay, but this one is, th is three three. This is two, right? This is two. But when we're checking these two two, uh, this one one sums to two. But actually, we can calculate it in another way. It's like 3 minus this one. It occurs to me that in another problem, that uh, usually if we are counting some sum up or something, which is the pre-calculated pre array, that is sum i, means uh, the, the, the sum of this one, sum of two, sum of three, we will help us to, to uh, extract the real sum by just divide, just be, just be Subtraction. So, if I am to check that the end, the the, the subarray which adds the k by ending to this item, we can just check the sum of total sum, and the check the, the 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 counterpart. Yeah, right. So the total sum is three. So we only check to if to check there are something uh, called there's some one sum to one from the zero. Yes, there's O E S one, right? This one, this is three, and this must be two. And this is two, and this is uh, this is two, and we can just say uh, with no elements, zero. So the sum is zero. So two minus zero is also. Wow, this is a genius, I think. I need to uh, uh, consider more. So, uh, but allow me to write down the formula. So, so the, the, the core idea, core I, idea is that sub, we are we are talking about subarray. Sum of subarray 
equals actually sum i minus count sum counterbar and actually sum counterbar is already calculated in sum i so we we let the sum equals zero for i let i equals zero i smaller than arms i then i i plus plus so sum plus nums i you see that some counterpart is already calculated so we need to map to store it, store it right so now we get a num sum we create a map cast map equals new map zero one so this means that uh, uh, there are always option of zero with which is without elements so without elements which which just uh, the case of starting from is index zero so uh, if you want to get a k we'll just uh, search right search if because we are looping through the end of the of the range so we only need to check if a map has um, sum minus k if that's the case we will plus map get sum k okay that's done and of course we have to store ourselves set sum update might get sum zero plus plus one okay it's done it's much faster right 72 millisecond wow this is genius i have to say this just for some cases don't don't but uh don't keep thinking about the start line but also consider the ending line or in a reverse order if you just think a starting line here one 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 it will cost some more time but if we also consider from the reverse reversed like from the uh from the from the rare you set okay one two is two okay uh what two two is what and then it might be might be uh, a turning point that we can consider a uh, subtract the, the sum array um uh but i'm not really explaining this very good okay anyway here are some hints brute, will, will brute force work here it's a sure work can we optimize by use some extra space mm -hmm. What about using some storing some some frequencies in the hash table? Would it be useful? Wow, some I equal some out when some will repeat the sum over the missing. Can we use the priority to optimize it? Wow, this gives a hint. Wow. Mm. This is a really good question. You know. So that's all for this one. See you next time.